Every year in Canada, an estimated 45,000 people die from sudden cardiac arrest. That's one death every 12 minutes. Defibrillation is the only effective treatment for sudden cardiac arrest. But now a technological breakthrough. It's called an implantable cardioverter defibrillator, or ICD. And it has the potential to save lives and today can be monitored remotely by your physician. Dylan Tracy is one of the first people in Canada to receive Medtronic's newest implantable ICD. The cardiac history in my family is quite a broad spectrum. Uh, my dad being the carrier of it and through his family tree, um, unexplained deaths. Biggest benefit um, as a parent for having a child with an ICD, I think, is just having that security, knowing that wherever he is, whatever he's planning on doing with his life, that he'll be safe. The stopwatch size device alerts medical staff to any noticeable changes in the patient's condition or potential problems. Dr. Larry Stearns is a cardiologist in Victoria. Defibrillators have come a long way in 25 years. This new generation of uh, defibrillator is actually the, the most automated device that we've ever developed. Uh, these devices can actually check themselves on a daily basis. They also monitor for any heart rhythm problems and store everything in a log. The ICD implant procedure is actually a very straightforward procedure. You know, small incisions made in the shoulder uh, through which the device and the wires leading to the heart are placed. Uh, the device is tested and the patient's allowed to recover for a few hours, often to go home the same day or possibly the next morning. Remote monitoring is done through the Medtronic CareLink network. By using a standard phone line, patients can transmit data directly to their doctor's office. Dr. Richard Hooper is Dylan's clinic doctor in his hometown of Kelowna, B.C. Using CareLink, we of course can communicate with the patient at home and the patient with us, and that way we can be reassured, as can the patient, uh, as often as the, the information is transmitted that it is working properly. So the important thing for a patient like Dylan is that this can be done at home. It saves them a trip to the clinic, it saves them a trip to the hospital, and in his instance, because his device is wireless, it can be done while he's asleep. Going for regular checkups is an inconvenience a lot of time for myself. I have to go every six months, I have to leave work, take time off work, sit in a waiting room. I am very relieved uh, with the ICD, um, knowing where he's going with his future in world travels and stuff, I know there's a backup plan. For more information about whether implantable cardioverter defibrillators or ICDs are right for you, speak with your doctor. Sherry Demetarko reporting.